This Raw Vision video is brought to you by Metro Solar, proud partner of the Richmond Football Club. Yeah, it was a weird day, the lead up to the draft, and um, the whole week rather. Um, yeah, weird emotions, it was excitement, I was nervous, um, didn't know if I was going to get drafted or where I was going to go, whether I was going to stay in Victoria or go into state. Yeah, the whole year I was pretty much normal. Just try to play football and concentrate on um, my game instead of thinking about next year, which was so far away. But as it got closer, it started yeah, dragging out a bit and sort of waiting. But when the day came, yeah, that's when the nerves hit, but also excitement and to hear my name read out was a very exciting moment. It's full of draft. I was just at home, had some um, family and friends over. Luckily got drafted, otherwise it would have been a bit embarrassing. Um, but all of us were nervous, probably more than myself. It was a normal day up until sort of five o'clock area. I started getting a bit more yeah, serious and um, could possibly happen. Um, but yeah, I was thankful for my name to be read out. I had an um, interview with Richmond and they seemed happy but I only saw them one so um, I wasn't thinking, yeah, here we go, Richmond, they'll pick me up. It was more sort of, I didn't know where I was going, if I was going to go, so it was uh, a bit of a lottery. So, But I was happy to stay here in Victoria and then Richmond's such a um, high profile club. So that was even better, I think. When my name got read out, um, everyone jumped up and started yelling. Got pretty emotional, I had everyone giving me hugs and kisses and um, yeah, I was trying to hold in the emotions, but tearing a bit. Yeah, it was a great moment and um, everyone was really happy and yeah, I had a good night. Once we called my name, I had to realise that I'm going on to Richmond with Corey, who's um, been my mate for a few years and playing at the Jets together, um, Vic Metro. I think it just added on how special it was to share this experience with someone who I've played football with a couple of years before, both trying to reach the same dream. So yeah, that was really exciting and yeah, I got in touch with him and just said we're both going to Richmond, we both couldn't believe it and um, yeah, very exciting. On the Saturday we came in and just went through um, the club, just having a look around, had a lunch with a couple of the players, Ben Lennon, Ivan Soldo and Jack Rewa ended up coming. Um, a bit starstruck I was back then. And yeah, then the next day on Sunday we went straight to the camp, which um, was very tough up in Townsville, nice and hot, got burnt, which was good. But yeah, it was a great experience to sort of get straight into it and mingle with the boys that way. Yeah, when I got told in the morning that I was going to be playing my first game, I was trying to hold in the smile while I told my mum and try to keep a straight face, but um, yeah, it came out, it was pretty obvious. And then, yeah, just the whole experience was something I'll never forget and just running out, um, warming up and then just taking in the crowd against Collingwood, biggest crowd I've played in by a long way. But yeah, just to run out on the field when I got my opportunity was um, yeah, something I'll never forget and I'll cherish it forever. If I had to give advice to the new players coming out, I'd just say enjoy the moment, um, be ready for hard work and um, just earn the respect of the players. Um, I think, yeah, just not be shy. Um, the quicker you can uh, talk to the players and get a good relationship, I think the quicker your development um, will start to happen and that's how you start to get games and start playing good footy.